Hi there and welcome to my channel. I'm Liz and today I have a fun bootcut denim haul for you. I would say that bootcut denim is my number one favorite. Um, so let's Let's discuss, what's, what are your top three favorite cuts? I would say mine, number one, boot cut, number two, actually the wide leg, and number three, a classic straight cut. Um, so let me know your top three favorites. I would say boot cut is, is my, just my go-to. I feel it's the most flattering. So I felt like I needed to kind of up my collection. Uh, in a recent clean closet clean out that I did, I noticed that a lot of my boot cut, which I had for years and years, was a little on the lower cut side and I just wasn't reaching for them. So I have kind of sprinkled in some boot cut recently in some other hauls, but I needed a few more and then down the road, I'll do a video on like my favorite favorite ones that I do have. So maybe some of these will make it into that video. If you're interested to see my first impression thoughts and try on on these uh, boot cut jeans, then just keep watching. Okay, so I have the haul out here and all, so these are all going to be pretty classic, uh, classic colors, no distressing, because I like to be able to wear them uh, for work, for dressy, and I, I just am not into the distress style. But I would say where there is some interest is in the pocket, so let's get to the try on. Okay, ladies, the first one that I tried on are these black Miss Me boot cut jeans. These are a mid-rise boot cut in a 29 by 34. And uh, let's go over the features. I would say there isn't very much stretch in them. I did like the black hardware. So all of the hardware is a nice kind of shiny black with the Miss Me logo on them. Um, something that I really like is they actually have a two-tone kind of thicker black uh, stitching on throughout so that you don't have to have that high contrast, but it is contrast, which I think is kind of neat. So the pockets have a fake flap in the back. So these do not open. Uh, it is a regular slotted pocket, which is great because sometimes I throw my phone in there. And the uh, rise, the length, and the opening of the boot cut is all perfect for me. I probably could have sized down one. Uh, this does say it's a slim fit. So I went for my true size, which is 29, but I probably could have done a 28. There isn't much stretch though, and these fit really nice. So overall, I like them. The pocket placement is always important to me and the you know overall length regardless of what length it says i always have to try them on because i've seen some that say 33 and they fit like a 31 <laughs> for me um so these ones do have a nice length i like how they look with my boots on they um are just really good overall and definitely needed another pair of black denim so um you know black denim can be dressed up or down so really happy with uh these ones overall and the second pair that i tried on are from true religion and they are the becca mid-rise boot cut in a 28 i actually it doesn't say the length on here uh so i'm not sure but um they were an all right length. I would say they were just a tad short on me, um, but they have some neat details. So I kind of liked the little pocket and it is working right there. It does have a kind of a silver and copper hardware, so a little mix there. And then the flat pockets are nice. A lot of the you know styles do have kind of the different tone stitching. So that was nice. The rise was uh, good. The boot cut opening size I thought was just perfect as well. And they are a nice dark wash jean overall. So like really, really light fading, but no bleaching or distressing or anything like that. So um, overall, uh, I'm on the line on these ones. I'll have to watch back in editing. 
Um, I would say if you're a little shorter than me, these might work perfectly for you. Um, as far as stretch goes, there is some stretch in them as well, but I wouldn't say super stretch, just you know, a light to medium stretch. And overall, a nice denim, I think. <laughs> and then real quick, these are not boot cut, but they snuck in, so I just wanted to throw them in here. These are the True Religion Billy Mid-Rise Straight, and I got these in a 28. These ones are really stretchy, um, and they kind of have the same coloring as the last pair. Uh, same hardware, two-tone hardware, but you know, just the regular pockets. The mid-rise was okay, it was a little short, but um, not bad. And then just regular pockets in the back, but um, I would say very light fading as well, but just wanted to throw those in. They're not part of the boot cut, so we won't spend too much time on those. The third pair of True Religion, these are also a Becca uh, boot cut, but they're in a high rise and a little bit of a different look. So I would say these are high rise. I actually liked the front of these. Um, they were a good amount, but it has a bit too much uh, fading or bleaching for me. So if you do like that, um, you know, these are a nice deep like blue, like they have a lot of blue in them. They do have stretch in them. And again, the length uh, wasn't my favorite either. I would have maybe wanted them about an inch uh, longer for me and the boot opening is a pretty good size the stitching in the back is white and it just has the two slided slotted uh, pockets so overall you know I would say a classic denim oh I just noticed this it has <laughs> the uh, design on the little pocket right there as well so overall, I mean, these are nice quality uh, denim. If you haven't tried out these, this site and you are you know, wanting to try some on for yourself, I would say look out for a sale, uh, but the true religion is popular among the youngsters. <laughs> okay, ladies, I had high hopes for these because looking at them, they were so, they're like everything. Like I love this classic wash no distressing no fading no bleaching no whiskering none of that so these are the a goldie soft stretch nico boot high rise slim boot <laughs> all of that and i did pick these up in a 29 i loved how they fit in the front um it's just got the silver button there and then the copper buttons there um Overall, in the front, I loved them. They're too short for me, uh, far too short. And the pockets in the back were just, this is what I'm talking about. They weren't, they, they weren't helping me. So, uh, you know, I don't have a whole lot going on there. So if you're curvier than me, these may work for you. That is why you have to kind of try on your own denim. Uh, you know, every all of us are so different that you can't you can't know until you try them on. So, I thought the the pocket in the back was too big and too low for me, so that didn't work out. And you know, so between the pocket and the length, these do not work for me at all. But I love them. If they made these pockets a little smaller and made this a little longer, I, these would be perfect for me. Oh, and no stretch, not stretchy at all. So if you want a, you know, hefty denim that's gonna hold you in, be nice and thick, these are, uh, I mean, they're just such a nice denim. So I'm probably gonna uh, check out this site and see if I can find something else because now I need to find one in this brand. <laughs> okay, ladies, the next pair are these Gypsy High Rise from Idle Wind, Idle Wind, I think. And I picked these up in a six, 34 long. And when I first was putting these on, I was like, why the heck did I get a six? And I did because these said they had a lot of stretch. They even have a Lycra label on them. Um, and let me tell you a little bit about the features before my opinion. Uh, so there is a lot of stretch in them, but they're kind of a, like a medium to thicker weight denim. I. The color I would say is kind of a medium with some fading. They do have kind of a muted, like dark grayish hardware, so very understated. I liked the rise. 
Um, I really like the pockets. I actually like that there's not a whole lot going on. It has the brown and then just a little wavy line there. Um, just all the normal pockets. I love the length. I love the opening and I love how these look. They were like, I was like, the color is kind of a kind of bright blue, I would say, but uh, not too bright, but oh my gosh, these held and lifted all of the right things. <laughs> I was very impressed. So that's why you gotta try everything on. You just never know. Um, so these surprised me. I would say these are probably, you know, not like a fancy work kind of denim, but like a great going out, uh, hanging out kind of denim. Uh, was really happy with the fit and feel of these ones. Okay, and the next pair I tried on are a classic, and that is Wrangler. I know that's sold lots of places. I did pick this up in a 34, or nope, what, 29, 34 length. And these are the Westward High Rise. So they are a light wash denim. And I'm not sure if I have any boot cut um, light wash, but the hardware is all copper. There is some fading, um, but no whiskering. I'm kind of not a fan of the whiskering too much anymore. I guess there is a little bit of distressing on the pocket, but that's really minimal. Um, I liked the high rise and just a classic denim, I would say. You could just wear this any day doing anything. And overall, um, I think I like them. I, I really like the length. Um, they, the pockets I'm unsure of, and you know, I obviously just did a kind of a quick try on. So I have to think about these a little bit more. I think I like them. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts. Okay, ladies, and next up are these uh, Ariat uh, Perfect Rise. These are actually a straight cut, so another straight cut made it into my haul, but I would say these were almost like a baby boot cut look. So um, let's go through. So it just calls itself the perfect rise. I don't know what that means. I thought it was actually a little bit low, but they fit so good. <laughs> so I'm kind of against a low rise and they might be like a little low to mid rise, but they are doing all the things. They're holding everything in on the front and the back, which I love. These are in a 28 long. They're very stretchy. There's a lot of stretch in them. They do have kind of a dark gray button detail with some white stitching. Um, they do have kind of the whiskering, which I don't like in the fading, but the fit is so good that I might consider these. <laughs> and then I like the pocket detail. I like the pocket placement and size, all of the things. The, um, again, the opening, it is a straight leg, but it almost is like a boot, like a baby boot cut is what it reminded me of. Um, I might see if they have this in a different color, but um, other than that, the fit was exactly the kind of thing I'm looking for. Okay, and the next pair that I picked up are from a brand called Cleo and Wolf. They are a high rise boot cut. I got these in a 28 by 34. And overall, I would say it does have some of the whiskering, but it's very light. Uh, I wish there was none and a bit of fading. They do have a raw hem, which is something I don't normally go for, but if you do because you need to cut them, uh, these do have a raw hem, um, so there is that. I'm, I'm unsure about that. I usually try to stay away from that, but I think I liked the color of these, so I needed to see them in person. They do have kind of the classic like faded gold uh, buttons, and then they do have kind of the tan or like coppery stitching. These uh, were a nice rise, uh, so that was good in the front, and the pocket placement in the back worked just good for me. So everything was really good for me on these. Um, let's see, stretch, they're very stretchy, very stretchy. Um, and overall, I would say like minimal fading, uh, minimal you know design and things, kind of a classic look. 
So overall, a nice denim. I, I'm glad that I tried this brand and this size uh, or this like fit out. So another contender. All right, ladies, some really good brands to consider. I had a definite win, which was the first pair of the Miss Me and a definite miss. That was the A Goldie. Uh, the fit just was not for me. The rest kind of falls somewhere in the middle. So I'm gonna have to, uh, you know, double check in the editing, probably try them on again. But I, you know, love trying these on. Um, you know, I, I'm always on the hunt for like just a really great feeling, you know, peace, whatever it is, and something that's flattering to me, which is what I would encourage you to do. Don't settle for something that you don't like. And also don't be afraid to try different brands. So depending on the fit that you want or the need, there is something out there. <laughs> so don't give up. It takes some work. But um, hopefully, you know, you will find what you love and I am really picky about finding what I love. So hopefully this was informative and fun for you. If it was, please consider giving this video a like so YouTube will press it out to more ladies that it may potentially help. If you haven't subscribed yet, it's free and I sure would appreciate it if you would consider doing so. I wanted to thank you so much for dropping in and spending some of your time with me. Uh, I hope that you have a great day and I hope to see you in the next one.